In this video, I'm going to split one of these stone blocks right down the middle using my foot. Well, not just my foot. My foot and also this foot-powered hydraulic stone splitter. I've never tried this before in my masonry work, but apparently you can use it to split stone blocks for pillars like this. The power comes from this hydraulic device underneath. You build pressure using a foot pedal on the side, and you can see that foot pedal over here, gradually building the pressure by pumping that up and down and pinching a stone between this bottom sharp-edged wedge here and a corresponding wedge on the top as you pump the foot pedal. And eventually the pressure builds to the point where apparently the stone that you have in there splits right down the middle. So the first step is to let the pressure, any residual pressure, out of the hydraulic pump and push the base all the way down and then close that hydraulic valve again so that we can start building pressure for a stone that I'm going to put in there. I don't have one in there yet, of course. And then we need to raise the top wedge with this crank handle on the top to make room to slide a stone inside. Now I've got a stone in there and I'm beginning to build pressure with the foot pedal, just pumping it up and down. As the pressure builds, it's getting harder and harder for me to push the pump pedal down, but it's not too hard, even as the pressure builds quite high. And there you have it. The stone split and only took a few pumps. And look at that, a nice, clean, flat, split surface. Nice natural look for a stone block for masonry work. Didn't have to break out the stone saw, didn't have to get covered in dust. So now let's try it again. Going to release the pressure here, lower the platform, put another stone in there. This time I want to see if I can get the stone actually splitting close up and in slow motion. So I'll raise the top wedge again, make some room. It's quite a robust device. Lots of heavy sheet steel in here. We'll use this stone, about four inches thick or so. Just position it 90 degrees to the wedges. And I'm now lowering the crank handle to take all the slack out, so to speak. And now I'm building pressure again, pumping that uh, hydraulic foot pedal. Wow. Look at that. It just blasts apart in an instant. Such force. And once again, we have this beautiful, flat, quite geometrical split surface. Perfect for working into a masonry wall. 